Hey everyone, thanks for tuning in to another Geek Station review. Now this week I've got another serial review for you, and it's an old favorite. Captain Crunch's Home Run Crunch. Let's take a look. Now I realize that Home Run Crunch isn't new per se, though this is the first time that the Quaker Oats Company has brought it out since 2008. Now for those of you who aren't familiar with Home Run Crunch, it was originally introduced in 1995 and then again in 1996. Then it was 10 long years before Quaker reintroduced it in 2007 and 2008. And of course now, nearly a decade later, it's back once again. Now Home Run Crunch has changed quite a bit over the years. With the 1995 and 1996 release, the cereal itself was shaped like bats and balls, while there was also marshmallows included in the cereal that were shaped like pennants and bases. Then when it was re-released in 2007, we got the shapes that we have now, which include the traditional Captain Crunch cereal and then bat and ball shaped crunch berries. Now looking at the box of this newest version, you can see that as usual, the box art is just fantastic. You may recall my last Captain Crunch review that I talked about how much I love the artwork for these boxes, and this one's no different. They're just so colorful, vibrant, and creative. As you can see, my favorite part of this box is the fact that the bowl itself is shaped like a baseball, which is so great. It's too bad that they don't have some kind of giveaway where you could send in proof of purchase so you could actually get one of those. That'd be awesome. Now taking a look at the backside, you can see it's the same. Beautiful, colorful, vibrant, and it has a lot of little games that you can play to keep yourself entertained while you're eating the cereal, which a lot of companies don't seem to do anymore. Now, as you can see, it says, knock your morning out of the park with Home Run Crunch. And Captain Crunch is saying, remember, keep your eye on the ball. By the way, where is the ball? Now here underneath the picture, it says, how many different balls can you find? And when you look across the box, you can actually see there's a ton of balls here. There's, I can see a soccer ball, a football, a bowling ball, a pool ball. And underneath the fish, it actually looks like there's a little Easter egg and it looks like a pokey ball. Now off to the left hand side, it says, find at least 20 things that don't belong. And of course, there's a lot of things that don't belong in here, like a can of corn, a fish, a goat, a vacuum, among many others. Lastly, on the bottom of the box, it says, it's a game of pitches. Can you unscramble and match up the names of each of these pitches? And I'm not even gonna try. Now let's take a look at the cereal itself. Obviously, nothing special here. It's basically just Captain Crunch cereal with baseball and bat shaped crunch berries. Either way, it looks great. All right guys, so that brings us to my favorite part, the taste test. Mm, what can I say? It's Captain Crunch with crunch berries. There's no real difference other than the shapes. So if you're a fan of Captain Crunch, you're gonna love this cereal. All right, thanks for tuning in, and don't forget that I'm giving away a Nintendo NES Classic Edition. All you have to do to win is subscribe. Once I hit 1,000 subscribers, I'm gonna give that away to one lucky winner. I'll see you next time.